Hello guys, welcome back to playing with Raggedy Boy, and today I'm back on my Attack of the B-Team server. Now, um, I would have released an episode earlier, but I don't even know what I did, and it's just bleh. So, I decided I wasn't going to release that one, but, uh, so... Uh, this episode is going to be a bit more of just explaining a bit what I've done, because, yeah, as I've explained before, I'm not even sure what I did, but, let's go down and check. Okay, I have this set up, which is bounce pads, which does what the name implies, it bounces you up in the air, but the, uh, if you take all of these different bounce pads, the bounce accumulates, and when you get to the end, you just launch yourself really high in the air. So I'm just gonna- oh no. I'm, you're not supposed to see that yet. And just take that. And it flings you all the way up. And then you just land. Now, another thing I've been working on, which, I mean, you still would have seen in the other episode, but oh well. Can it, I can't do anything about it now. Uh, oh no. Um, uh, is... Not that, that, that's not part of it, uh, I mean it was, but, here you go. Now this, I'm actually, I'm really proud of this, this is, I like this, this looks, I'm pleased with how this looks. Um, it's factory blocks, they're actually pretty cheap to make, it's, uh, let me show you the, uh, factory, let me show you the, the recipe. Factory block, right here. That's all it is, and it gives you 32, and as you know, I have like 320-something uh, iron, and a bunch of cobble, 3,000 cobble. Um, so you just come around this corner, and this brings you to the first area, which is going to be the minigame room. with That has lots of mobs in it that I don't want here. <laughs> die mobs, die. Now... Uh, before I get into this, I want to start working on maybe the mini games, uh, the mini game ideas, and in this episode. But first, I want to show you the uh, grinder. Now you may remember it used to have a blaze spawner, but it got really annoying after a while, and I just decided to break the spawner. Which there's tons of other blaze spawners in the Nether because we found so many Nether fortress. Says, yep, fortresses. And so I just put this skelly spawner up here. Where is the entrance? Did I have an entrance? I don't think I had an entrance. Oh, okay. There. It, yeah. So, I mean, you can just AFK here and they'll get pushed in. And, oh, jerk. That was it nice. And basically, I was worried about this being an issue, the spawner in the way. But, um... They get pushed off. The chances of them spawning there aren't as high spawning anywhere else. So we'll just come down here and this uh where my cursor is pointing right now. That way the water's flowing, we'll just push them straight down there and they'll fall and get killed by the grinder. Now I'm not very good with this thermal expansion stuff, so I'll have to figure out how to do it. But uh, I have this set up and I want to take okay. I want to take this, and these are the item outputs, which I, I thought, well, if I do this, then the item outputs, can it can just put all the items out through here, but it's not doing that. We got a nice bow. Um, so, I wasn't sure how to get this to work, but I'm probably going to do that off camera. Uh, I'm not going to AFK here or anything because I don't want the items just to shoot all over the ground and every time I come near it, it gives them to me. So I'm not going to do that. Um, uh, another thing I want to show you real quick is K Hanley's slash Mater 27s. Is that? No, K Hanley isn't on. Okay, so, um... This is what he's been doing. He's making a beacon, a triple beacon, right here out of miscellaneous uh, blocks of ore. Uh. And so, basically, the most interesting thing that's happened here is his 
Oh, oh, oh. Uh, is his, um, the grinders he set up. He has a wither skeleton grinder. And, you know what, fine. Uh, witch grinder. Now, the witch grinder, he just got a spawner. But you may think, well, what about the wither skeleton grinder? There are no wither skeleton uh, spawners. Well, simply all he did was he used the essence that he got from this and brought it all the way over here and there's power system right there as well and he brought it over here and when he wants to he can turn it on and it powers it and it grinds the wither skellies and you get this and uh, most of the time you just get coal, wither skeleton skulls, uh, necrotic bone most of the time that's what you get in a couple of you know like these things for necromancy but every once in a while you get a red heart which is very useful and I only have seven of them and I think you need them all the way through to get to the higher tier hearts but um, that's what's going on up there and that's kinda of what I want to set up over at my other base but I want to set up like a, a grinder for everything basically it's gonna be grinding every single mob I can think of that works I don't think iron an iron golem works I, I want to see all the trophies real quick okay let's check Tro Wow what is that even oops I don't need to do that um can I see an iron golem trophy? Golem. No, I guess there's no trophy. I don't think it shows the trophies. Um. Huh, that's funny. The arrows get stuck. Now, let's go work on our base down here. I would eventually like to transfer all the chest system down here and hopefully get the machines. The machines are easy. Move the portal. Well, no, I'll probably keep the portal up here. But I'll move the uh, grinder down and the mob essence and the spawner. And um, keep the farms up here. And this will be like my witchery area afterwards. But for now, we're just in the building stage unless I can somehow move everything down here but I want to use that island because what's the point of making it if you're never gonna use it again okay this is what I have so far now what I wanted to do with this was make a mini game and have it be a parkour that's about all I know yeah so maybe not do that today because I don't know what else I want to do with it um we're gonna have a tunnel go off in this direction oh no I'm gonna have to go power up my hammer um now let's put all of these I can put everything else away as well but um so we do want to make uh, more tunnels, so we probably want to start with the chest system. The chests, they need to have a place to go, and I don't like them up here. And also, I need to start a farm for these. I'm going to have a tree farm that we're going to start up over here as well, eventually. All in, due t all in good time, though, we can do that. Uh, I'm going to need some torches... Get rid of that, 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 actually we'll keep that. Um, this is so I can also store things as well. Um, now what was I gonna get? Oh no, I forget. Now I remember, okay, I want to build more of these lamps, which basically just requires... Let's get some glowstone. Whoa, what did I do? Um, yep, I turned it off again. Let's go get some glowstone. Uh, let's take a stack of glowstone, 64, and then we'll take bones. Actually, let's go make use of our grinder over here and take the bones from that. 
There we go. Okay. I think I can just set up a normal chest and work that way. We might want to go look at Kay Hanley's later to see what he's done. But... Oh. Uh, glowstone. And we need a bit of iron, which I have enough of. See? Okay. Basically, I'm going to make tons and tons and tons of iron bars, and that may see, seem stupid to you that I'm making all these iron bars, but these lights are more expensive than you'd think. And I do need all of these iron bars. Okay, hey, there we go. So, we'll do that. Uh-oh. Uh, there we go. And so now we need more of the white aluminar. So, um, I'm going to be adding some music into this episode. Um, YouTube has a special... I need some more circuit plates. YouTube has a special thing that allows you to put music into your videos. Um, and if when you actually watch this and there is no music, please just ignore what I'm saying. But it's planned. It's planned to have you music. Just to make things seem, you know, a little less, um... I'm not even sure. N not happeningness. Yeah, there you go. That's a, that's a word, obviously. You hear that? That's like an everyday conversations word. Okay. Uh, we'll take these. Actually, nope. First. Take that. Then we put these in. And... Put that on top. And I've already made the luminar. And I guess that's good enough for now. So, I forgot the last thing that I knew I needed to do. Which was charge up my hammer. Um, after that, what I need to do is create more carpenter's blocks. See, I have an energy, or that's an induction smelter. I don't think I want to put it in an induction smelter. That's a magma crucible. There it is. Okay. And now I need tons and tons of wood, which I have a lot of. We'll just take all of that, which it probably doesn't have all of that, like always. Sometimes these request pipes, they tell me I have something, but I don't really have them. Can be annoying at times, but... Oh well, what are you going to do about it? Okay, there we go. That should be enough sticks. I was about to go try and craft there. Okay, we'll do that. And then we'll do that. And take the sticks and go like that. Well, what? Why isn't that working? Carpenter... Carpen... There's wedge slope, which is that one. Oh, I'm smart. Very smart, as you can see. Uh, how do you make one of the uh, carpenter's blocks again? Why would you put a helmet? What kind of helmet? That's a stick? How is that a stick? That is the weirdest stick I've ever seen. I don't know, maybe it's common these days, but I don't think it is. You don't see those growing off of the trees. What's that? Oh, it's a stick. No, no, it's not. It's a helmet. No, it's a stick. It's been scientifically proven it's a stick. But it doesn't look... No, shush. See? That's what's going to happen. People will have their heads blown up as they realize it's been scientifically proven that it is in fact a stick even though it looks nothing like a stick and technically isn't a stick it is well that was a fun story uh... let's get back to focusing on things uh, okay i have bread there we go now which pathway should i go off to Basically, the uh, paths are going to get lower and lower as I go down. Or obviously, it's going to get lower if I go down, but 
Uh, let's go this way. And I think right about here, we can go down one. This will be one of the uh, lower levels that uh, only certain level people can go down because I'm going to have different levels. There's going to be like, okay, whatever, red level, blue level, purple, orange, black, blah, 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 blah level. Oh, annoying. That is annoying. Well, um... But basically, that's what I'm going to do, and I'm going to go all the way down and have different level tunnels, and if you're not that level, I will have security guards down there, and you'll see what I mean when I finally get to that point, but I'll have security guards down there that will uh, shoot at you if you try to go down there. So, um, I'm going to do a little bit of work off camera, and I will see you in a moment. I'm back, guys, and I've just realized this is going to take longer than I thought it would. So, um, it's a bit of a short episode, but I think I'm going to have to end it here. Uh, sorry I didn't get to do much. I didn't realize I'd been sitting there talking for so long, but, yeah. Um, anyways, thank you for watching, and if you like this, please consider leaving a like and a comment. And a comment just, you know, for feedback. And also tell me if you like the music. If you do, then, you know, of course, leave a comment. And please leave a comment, because I keep telling you guys to, and you don't do anything. So, I, I need this feedback. So, um, that's about it. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.